Hey everybody, welcome back to Hocus-Pocus.com. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna look at the Switchalope from Arnaud Vin Ratched. Uh, this is a four-way out envelope. I'm not giving anything away, it says that in the trailer. Uh, <laughs> and really, this is a stage prop. It's a big, beautiful stage prop. Let's say you do stage magic, parlor magic, uh, kids magic, anything like that. Uh, this is something you'd probably put on a tripod, something that your assistant would hold. It'd be up on stage, you do your trick, you got four outs, and uh, bammo, you pull out an orange envelope and it's gonna match whatever the audience member picks. All right, you're excited too. You order it, it comes to you in the mail. What are you gonna get? You're gonna get a giant envelope. <laughs> you're gonna get a giant package. A giant package is gonna show up and you're gonna say, what is this? Oh yeah, it's a switchalope I ordered because <laughs> it's a, it's huge, right? They pack this flat they don't fold it at all. There's nothing for you to construct or build or glue or stick or tape, okay? This comes ready to go. So they're gonna pack this really well for you. So yeah, expect a big box to show up. Expect a large envelope inside. Uh, large envelope and then you get your four prediction envelopes. You're also gonna get a download code It'll take you out to the internet and give you access to a 14 minute video. And you're always trying to watch the trailer and kind of decide, okay, you know, what, what is this? What, you know, how would I do this? Uh, and, you, and you know it's a four way out envelope. You know that going into it, but I think the method is very creative. As far as angles and inspectability goes, um, you're never going to show the backside. Let's, let me just put that out there. You're never going to show the backside. So in reality, you could have anything back there. You could have your crib sheet back there. I mean, you could put your crib sheet in giant bright red letters. Nobody's ever going to see the back. So there's nothing to ever remember or memorize. Like you don't need to remember what's in every envelope. You can have a crib sheet back there for, for all you care. Uh, like I said, put it on a tripod, uh, do that routine. And then uh, as far as inspectability goes, let's say you pull the orange envelope out and you just ask the spectator, hey, come on, up, come on up here and I'll let you open it. You can hold the envelope in your hands like this. You tilt it towards them. You flip the tongue flap up. They see the prediction in the envelope. They put their hands in there and they pull it out. They read it, they can keep it. Uh, so there's kind of like a little bit of a touch there where the spectator might feel like, yeah, I saw it, I inspected it. As far as the video goes and how it is shot, uh, everything's well mic'd. Uh, it is only 14 minutes long, okay, it's not long. And there's kind of three sections to it. So the very first section is the trailer again. So within that 14 minutes, part of it's the trailer. So the explanation is even shorter, okay? Then you're gonna have two more sections. So the middle section is uh, him in an office setting. So like he's in a real like business office. He's sitting like at a conference table with a stationary camera. He's just gonna go over the contents of the box, which you're getting, and then maybe uh, go over a couple of like initial prep ideas as far as folding paper and inserting your uh, predictions. Then it's gonna flip back to the same kind of an environment he's in in the trailer. So it's kind of a black backdrop, much more formal, and then he'll go over a simple presentation. And because it's so short, you're not really getting a routine, okay? You're not getting a routine with any patter or anything like that. This is a four way out envelope for you and your effects. So if you've already got some calendar effect or date, anniversary effect, birthday, animal picking, uh, you know, who, a who done it kind of thing, or maybe a, a four way out card effect where you toss a deck into the audience, something like that, okay? So you've got a trick like that. This four-way envelope is gonna work with that. As far as it being well-made, it's beautiful. Uh, it's a beautiful prop and uh, it's nice, stiff cardboard material with a nice uh, cellophane see-through. Your four orange envelopes are nicely constructed. As far as practice and skill level, this is totally easy. Like I said, it's gonna come uh, to you ready to go. So there's nothing really for you to prep in advance. Uh, and as far as setup and reset goes, uh, you're just making sure your predictions are in the envelopes and your envelopes are back in their stations. And yeah, you're good. No sleight of hand, anyone could do this. No memory work, it's awesome. So I think if you could use a four way out envelope in any stage or parlor effect that you do, or like I said, children's magic, this is a beautiful prop that I guarantee you're gonna love. As far as price point goes, I think it's like 60 bucks somewhere in there, which is about what you'd expect to pay for a stage prop. Don't think of this as something you're gonna carry, uh, walk around or strolling <laughs> or street magic. Okay, this is, this is a stage prop. Stage props usually are expensive, okay? And it's so innocent looking. That's the other thing. It doesn't look like a $60 envelope. This looks like a, just a mailing envelope that comes to you, you know, th through the post. So it's innocent looking and yet so, 
devious. All right, so that's everything I can say about the switch elope for way out envelope. Of course, while you're here at hocus-pocus.com, we want you to keep shopping, look around, fill up your shopping cart, ask us any questions that you might have. We want to field those for you and we want to be your number one magic supplier on the internet. Thanks. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.